Ratty Dog. How we doing today? I'm out for my walk. Hope you guys are getting your walks in. How you doing? Good. And uh, we're just uh, strolling along. It's a beautiful day again. A little windy, a little breezy. And it's cool. Wow. We had a cool front move in. It's about 75 degrees there. It's mid-May. And it's 80, maybe 80 degrees at most, I bet. So I'm taking advantage while I can. Getting out, getting my walk in. Did you guys accept my challenge? It's a very easy challenge. May not challenge a lot of you, but there are many of you that need to start somewhere. So I'm, I'm giving this challenge. It's 15 minutes a day, three days a week. That's all it is. You pick the days. It doesn't matter. Just get out and get started. This will, this will show you that you can do this. Just find 15 minutes, three days a week. Go walk your neighborhood, walk around your house, whatever. It don't matter get out and do it and you'll see you'll start feeling better you'll start getting more energy and then you'll want to do it because you'll start feeling better so important that we start that we move as we get older most people as they get older they lose energy and they gain weight and they start having health problems I'm here to tell you you don't have to do that you don't have to do that. You can get, if you maintain, lower your weight as you as you get older, get you know, lose the weight, get back in shape. You'll be able to have more energy. You'll be able to play with your grandkids and be able to move and be mobile for as long as possible. One thing I know, man, I started down that road, 100 pounds overweight more than 100 pounds overweight really but uh i was almost pushing th almost 300 pounds my ideal weight is about 175 i was just pushing to get to 200 and uh i almost got there i'm not there yet but i'm almost there i did lose it and then i gained some back it's called life you know life gets in the way man and we just have to fail quickly and then get back on the saddle and start over again and continue to move. Main thing is, you just move. You gotta move. Walking is the best thing you can do. And that's what I'm doing after my walk. And I want all you guys, all you guys need to move. Uh, stretch your muscles. You know, living a sedentary lifestyle and sitting in your chair and you can just feel yourself growing old and getting stove up. You know, I used to sit at a desk, I'd sit at a desk and just, when I'd stand up, I was like, oh man, I just hurt all over from just sitting there so long. You can't do that to yourself. It's so bad for you. Get out and move. Get out and move. You know, if you're sitting watching TV, Wow, there's some kites. Cool. Those are cool birds. They're little hawks. But anyway, you can. <laughs> here I am. My ADD kicking in. I'm <laughs> I get sidetracked real easy. Anyway, but like, like, say you're sitting in your chair at home during the commercials. Just get up out of your stand up, sit down, stand up, sit down repeatedly until the commercial's over and your program starts again. Just do that for one program. I guarantee you, it will start making you feel better because you're moving, you're getting your muscles moving, you're getting your uh, blood pumping. And if you get in the habit of doing something like that, walking, passive movements of getting up and sitting down in your chair. You know, they make these chairs where you don't even have to get yourself up out of it anymore. It'll lift you up out of your chair. And that's all well and good, but if you start working the muscles to get you up and down out of that chair, then you won't have to have one of those until way later, you know, until maybe in your, you know, until you're way older. But anyway, guys, it's just really important to move, move, move. 
I'm getting ready to come up on a, uh, it looks like it's a garage sale. Chairs. I'm not going to look at that here in a minute after I get my walk in. I got to get my walk in first before I do anything else. <clears throat> you know, if you're like me, and I know a lot of you are like me, <laughs> you got to get your stuff, get your personal stuff done first thing. When you do that, you get your personal stuff done, then you got your whole day. If I wait too long, then there's always something getting in the way of my personal physical health you know there's somebody that needs help there's attention to you know I'm taking a real estate course so there's you know I got to get on that but if I don't get it done first thing before I ever get started on my day it just never gets done it just never happens and then I've lost a day many times if that happens after the day's over I'll think man I didn't get my walk in so I'll go and I'll get it done in the evening but sometimes I never get to it. We're getting ready to have to, my grandkids, are, we're gonna be watching our grandkids all summer. My son, God bless him, you know, he is uh, doing really good, but him and his wife are divorcing. They have three little children, two of them are in school, and now summer coming on, they're either going to have to put them in daycare and spend, you know, thousand dollars a month, or let old granddad here and Nana, that's Nana and Papa to my grandkids, <laughs> going to have to watch our grandkids. And that's fine. We love our grandchildren, and we want to help our son out, so he don't have to have that big expense. And you know, it pays dividends because we'll have a close relationship with our grandkids and uh, be able to enjoy them. We have a pool, they love to go swimming. We've got a nice swing set they can play on. We've got our dogs, they love playing with us. So it'll be good to have them for the summer during the day. He gets off work about four, so it'll be good to get him uh, squared away. Wow. Some people, look at this yard, man. I mean, really, come on. Have some pride. Good Lord. This place is a shithole. Makes the whole neighborhood look bad. People live like that. I wonder, it makes me wonder if anybody even does live there. Maybe it's abandoned. You know, shouldn't pass judgment and things like that. But anyway, Nan and Papa. Starting Monday, school's out, so they've got nowhere to go. We're gonna start, uh, we're gonna keep them for the summer. From 7.30 in the morning until 4.30 probably, when he gets off work. Anyway, we'll see where we get to. Anyway, I'm just moseying along. This is what you, need, you guys need to do, mosey along. Just get out and start walking. You have, main thing guys, remember this, please. You have to start moving. You have to. Sedentary lifestyle will put you in your grave early, period. It will, and I was headed there. I know all about it. I had heart problems. I was starting to have hip problems. I still have hip problems from all that excess weight. I had to have a heart surgery. And it, you know that extra weight just strained my heart so bad that I couldn't couldn't take it. But uh, that's the thing, man. Obesity is the number one killer in this country right now. And it's not the obesity that kills you; it's all the related health issues that come with obesity: kidney disease, liver disease, diabetes. It's just killing people. But and it's the weight the extra weight that's doing it. So guys, I want you guys to get into this channel. Look at these videos in here. Get on some of the training. This is not, the training in here is not hard in my YouTube channel. It's all stuff geared towards mature adults. 
and people that need to lose weight and people that want to get on a routine use this channel you know check pick a, a video every day there's over i think there's like 135 videos in here that you can use they're all good information about walking tips for exercise that you can do body weight exercises that kind of thing so i want you guys to subscribe i want you to hit the notification bell so you can get notified when i make a new vid a lot of people take me on their on their walks they listen to me as i you know because i you know, i say stuff but you know, they listen to me as they're going on their walks which is cool i like that i was a guy told me you know i need to put an app put a mobile app together with just audio of the trainings in here because they're simple easy to follow anyway i'm gonna keep moving along here and uh, if you guys to comment you know, let me know how you're doing with these videos let me know how you're doing with your fitness challenge three days a week 15 minutes a day very simple to get started anybody can find that time and here's the thing even if you can't find 15 minutes three days a week find five minutes a day find one minute a day the main thing is you've got to start on some sort of fitness routine getting yourself moving all right guys Okay, well, that's, I'm going to go look at this garage sale over here and pick me out some new, some new treasures. You guys have a blessed day. And remember, guys, today's a one of a kind. Live it in gratitude, okay? Man, that breath I just took, I ain't ever getting it back. You guys ain't never getting that breath you just took back either. Remember that. Remember that each breath is precious. Each day is precious. So let's live them in gratitude and thank God for them. And I'm going to for sure. I hope you guys do too. All right. God bless.